Welcome, Gemini, to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of March 15th to the 31st of 2023. <clears throat> As I was getting into the energy of the Gemini during this particular time, I feel that hope and knowing that your comforter will be there when you need it the most. So uh, your heart and your mind aligned with the divine will get you through difficult periods. Uh, I feel that having fun, you haven't had fun for so long that you don't know what it's like to laugh until your belly is aching. I feel that the Gemini need to realize that they're secure. They've been in worse positions and honest to God, you should hope for more because more is coming. You need to have fun, find pleasure in your relationships. Just find pleasure in your relationships, whether with your best friends, your uh, people around you, Gemini. That pleasure is going to produce an energy that uh, is like a high vibration energy that attracts like people. And that's who you want to uh, attract in your life. Life, like attracts like. What do the Gemini need to know as you're listening to this video for March 15th to the 31st of 2023? What does the divine have in store for thee? Gemini. Illumination, illumination, and I got to tell you, when I see this card, it is as if, look how beautiful it is. So you're going to clearly see what you need to see. Maybe you are looking in another direction, at another person, another neighborhood, another career. And during this particular time, it's, you're going to see what you need to see. And this is in relationship. So it's going to deal with relationships at work, uh, just around you in your neighborhood. Um, career finance, Gemini, March 15th to the 31st of 2023. What does the divine have in store for the financially? Career, abundance. Gemini. There we go. Okay, let's go with love remation. It was illumination. So you're going to see exactly what you need to see, as we just said. Uh, career and finance, it's leadership. Look at that big polar bear, big white bear. Um, Leadership. Some of you own your own businesses. You're already assistant directors or you are you hold some kind of position uh, where you're working. Some of you are self-employed and there you go. There's your leadership role, no matter how you cut it. So that's your March 15th to the 31st of 2023. Now I started reading the, the shadow side and the strength of each sign, because when I give personal readings, that's what I do. I like to know who I'm reading for. So this is the strength of the Gemini, the strength. What is their light, their strength that pulls them through Gemini during this particular time? <laughs> sexuality and vitality. <laughs> so whether this is the dream of, the hope of, or the rekindling of, this is what pulls you through, Gemini. God bless you. That's your strength. Let's see what's your shadow side. What's holding you back from attaining your next goals? The shadow side of Gemini, what do they need to shed light on to move forward in their life? Gemini's shadow side, March 15th to the 31st of 2023. Where does the, oh, there we, oh, oh, okay. Gee, Gemini, we got two cards that flipped out.
Sorry about that. Oh, oh, it was worth getting. It was worth getting. Look at this, Gemini. Whew. Radiance, passion, soul empowerment. That came jumping out of the deck. Look at the word, soul empowerment. Birth. Some of you are going to be giving birth, whether it's to a physical child, to a business. Now, this also came out. So this is also a part of your strength. Wisdom, life force, regeneration, and spirit. So you already know it. You already know it, Gemini. You already know it. You just need to put it into action. And that is what always pulls you through. It's that strength. God bless. All right. Now let's see what your shadow side is of Gemini. March 15th to the 31st flipped out. So you're already doing it. Gemini. You're not devoted. Your devotion is is wavering. So whether this is in your physical life, in work, areas of work, diet, areas of uh, exercise what, or schooling, whatever this physical devotion, it could be your spiritual going to church. You don't even need to go to church. I mean, I, I, I don't want to say that, but it's about your spiritual. It's your communication between you and the divine between you and the divine. You need to stay devoted to yourself, to others. It's devotion. And you expect devotion from others. This is your shadow side. So this is what you need to pay attention to during this particular time, Gemini. Okay, Gemini, some of you um, are, uh, I'm gonna pull an, uh, another card, other cards I got out of this deck. What do the Gemini need to know as they're listening to this video? Any other messages from spirit and the divine to help the Gemini Ooh. during this particular time? It's the same thing. It's delight. That's delight. You, that's staying present in a moment and finding joy. And then this is potential. There, these are two different cards, I think possibly from another deck. Oh yeah, here, here, here's that one. It says security. That's basically potential. And then the, the delight, I think it was some kind of fun or joy. So look, Gemini, I really hope that this reading has helped you. If you would like to have a private reading, patrellasintuitiveinsights.com. It's listed in the link below. And with that, I'd like to say God bless you.